We're getting closer and closer to Casey's first pregnancy and I'm thrilled. Ew, she's just a kid. I'm Kelsey, I'm single, and today we thought it would be funny if I continued the 100 baby challenge. It's a challenge in The Sims 4 where you have a matriarch and they're supposed to have 100 different children, all with different parents. There's a lot of rules to this challenge, so if you're interested in those rules, the link will be below. We're trying to get Chelsea kind of out of the house and Casey aged up, but Chelsea can't leave the house and, you know, retire fully until Casey is of a young adult age. It's weird, we don't have any Todds. No Todds 2019! Enjoy this when we can, kids, because that's not gonna happen happen again for a long time. Let's make some drama. We're back in the Peter Schmay household and everyone's sad because someone died. <gasps> it was Casey's dad died. Oh my gosh, Casey. I am so sorry, sweetie. We're gonna save and go to Manage Worlds and we're gonna move out Freya and Nova, the two twins that should have done better. Honestly, you could have gotten out. We could have gotten more kids in, but that's okay. We're really happy with Casey. Casey's my everything right now. Stacy is also an adult, so we're gonna get them out. All right, so we got one teen and three kiddos. And a Chelsea. Oh my God, the Chelsea move out episode. When is that gonna go down? Maybe sleep in your own bed, serious, instead of mom's bed, all right? Chelsea, what are you, you hungry? You make your garden salad, girl. Taylor's sad too. He also lost a parent. What do you mean Taylor and Taylor also lost parents? Oh my gosh, Taylor and Taylor also lost their dad. Oh my gosh, there's two more. Oh wait, there's, she doesn't need to make a garden salad. There's hot dogs. <laughs> oh my God, everyone's crying. Everybody grab a hot dog. Oh, they're leaving. Bye, honeys. I love you both. Thank you guys so much for doing the most for me. I know it hasn't been easy. Sirius, where are you? Oh, he's right here. Oh, mortified. Stop looking at me. Sometimes it just feels like you can't do anything right and everyone is judging you. Aw, Sirius is going through a little teen mood swing in his little short shorts. Oh, what? Oh! I just had Sirius eat meat and he's a vegetarian. That's why that happened. Oh, honey, don't do that. Don't do it. Don't do eat the meat. Okay, you know what? Make your own. You've been cooking garden salad. I'm so sorry. Maybe Chelsea should write like a memoir. Oh, Olive's over on the computer. Didn't know you were here. Resume writing. Mother of 32. She already is writing a memoir. Wow, the things you set up and then forget about. The rest of the kids are super pumped. Taylor's going to wash the plates. Don't worry about that, Taylor. Okay, you just go to sleep, you sleepy head. Look at you, poor bean. All of my children are sad. That should be Chelsea's next book. All of my children are sad. And so am I. Oh my gosh, Chelsea. This is too sad. Yeah, girl, tell me about it. All right, all of my children are going to bed. It's a Monday PM, so they all actually need to wake up and do their homework before work school tomorrow. Oh, you need your skill up too. Creativity's almost a level two. So let's have you do your homework and then do a little bit of art here. Oh, geez, Taylor's upset. All of my children's parent died all at once and Chelsea sat, wow, everyone's just so sad. Homework's complete, good job, Casey. Okay, maybe you should do some extra credit work just in case you're a B student, so you might actually be a teen at the beginning of this episode, which is real fun. Chelsea finished her book. Yo, let's go. Good job, Chelsea. Why don't you publish that? Yeah, Literary Digest, mother of 32. Good work, everybody. How are you doing? Did you finish your extra credit? Casey did. So Casey, you deserve maybe a little bit of extra sleep and then you can do some fun, fun activities. We need a little bit of fun here because everybody's sad. Everybody wake up at 2 a.m. but Casey to get your stuff done. Aw, the two boys are doing homework together. Sirius' homework is complete. Whoop, whoop, whoop. He's a B student. I think he'll age up, which is great. Let's have you get some food. What is that? A hot dog, don't eat a hot dog. This like Todd room is so quiet. I love it. You're 100% done. Look at you go. Yeah, clean that up. And then you're gonna draw some shapes. Serious, how are you feeling, boy? <laughs> Aw, pretty good. Yes, level two. You're ready to go for school. I love it when that happens. I'm so excited for all my kiddos. Oh, everyone's going to school. Casey, why don't you go to school? I don't want you to miss out on anything. Everybody's off to school, so it's just Chelsea at the house today. What could we possibly get up to that might cheer Chelsea up? Oh, we could invite Charlie over. That would be quite cute, wouldn't it? But nah. 
We got bigger fish to fry. Craig! Oh, Craig. Hey, old Craig. Lots Having a bit of a blue day. You want to come so, uh, over and have some gosh. fun together? He'll be right over. Chelsea, you gotta pick out a new outfit, my darling. Change the clothes. There you go. You're styling now. You're ready for your boyfriend to come over. Is, is Craig her boyfriend yet? Maybe it's time to have that, like, conversation. <laughs> oh! Has to be boyfriend. She's too sad. Oh, why don't you kind of vent to him, my darling? Oh, Chelsea. Smirks. He like just walked in the door and she's already just unloading on him. Poor Bean. Aw, I think she feels better though. Give him residence keys. Oh, can we give more than one sim residence keys? I want you to have these keys, Craig. Thank you, Chelsea. Express admiration. Come on, Chelsea. She's get she's flirty up in this section here. Chelsea's finishing up her lunch. Who's calling? Oh, turn the cheat around. Turn the cheat around. A teacher caught Casey looking at another student's test during class and sent it to their office. Casey! I'm sure it was a mistake. Let her retake the test. She should fail the test. I think we want to raise her responsibility. So she should fail the test. Which makes me sad, but Casey, don't cheat. Don't cheat, kids. Where did Craig go? Honestly, we should lock this door for anyone who's not in the household. Get out! Get that passionate kiss. Yes, Chelsea! Ooh, we got a royalty report from Casey. Casey's first vlog made $100 today and uh, Life with 31 Siblings made $161. Unfinished assignment, when Taylor gets to class, he realizes his timeline is due. The one that was supposed to start a week ago. He eyes the stack of papers piling up on the teacher's desk. All he needs is a few minutes alone with one. Does he try to copy a class? No, no, Taylor. You're gonna confess the truth. He got a one-time extension. That's great. See, Taylor, it does not pay to be disingenuous. All right, here we go. Sharky. Oh, Chelsea! She go, she, she still got the moves. Whoa, recite some love poetry. It's getting steamy up in here. Tell an engaging story. I really want them to become best friends. I think they should have that conversation. Okay, here we go. Why are you sitting for this, Chelsea? Yeah, t take a stand, please. Please talk to him, person to person. <gasps> He's down, they're official! Ah! Oh my God, Craig is officially Chelsea's boyfriend. This is her first boyfriend. Oh my God, even, even our angry Olive is smiling. Why don't you give Olive a big hug and maybe share this? She's like, Olive! Craig and I just decided to become officially exclusive. So good. And now they're, uh, oh my, what? Did I just read that right? It's almost Chelsea's time. Make the most of these final days. I thought we'd have more time. Casey's not even aged up yet. We're not allowed to move Chelsea out until Casey's aged up. I wanted Chelsea to move Mary Craig and move out of the house and have her retirement. Freaking Sims always messing with my plans. Oh. Let's not panic. It's fine. Maybe we should just have the wedding soon. Maybe I need to check the rules and see if I can make Chelsea have a few more days because that is literally so unacceptable. All in-game rewards from completing aspirations and social events may be used, except the ones that prolong your Sims lifespan or save them from death. Everything is fine. You know what, let's have some, wait, what if she woohoos and we kill her? I was about to be like, let's have some fun. Let's have some woohoo. But now I'm afraid. Maybe she should just watch a movie with Craig. Let's not get crazy, all right? Movie night, come on. Let's all watch a movie together. Let's have some fun while we still can. Kelsey, stop. Craig is feeling this and Olive is skeptical of the movie choices that her mother made. Meanwhile, her mother's pumped. Oh, they're having a good conversation watching a movie together. This is the cutest thing. It's like they're a family. Cause kind of they are. Oh my gosh, I wonder who Casey's OTP is gonna be. Maybe Shawn Mendes, that's my other crush. Make Shawn Mendes and put him in the gallery and use hashtag Kelsey 100 movie challenge and maybe he'll be Casey's dad. Oh, what is happening on this? What? It's a mi- Oh my God, I've never thought to be scared of a man in a bunny suit. That's a lie, Johnny Darko is a thing. I, I forgot about that. Oh, this guy. 
what was that ending? She is in a better Good mood now. Oh, us. Craig's headed out. Hey, All right, fun. bye, Craig. We'll have you come over later. Oh, Where's Olive scooted going? over to be closer to her mom. Oh, Olive just headed out as well. Chelsea's, now Chelsea's alone and sad. When are the kids coming home? Now! Taylor is done with school. He did just fine. And uh, Sirius's grades are up. He's an A student. And Taylor did just fine. And Casey's an A student. We got two A jobs. Banana, banana. It's cake time because there are no parents to bring over. Sirius is feeling pretty confident but pretty tired. That's okay, my dude. You're going to be an adult soon. Look at you. Independent Lado. I love this jacket. Sirius aged up, and now we have a randomized street generator, so I definitely don't have a reason to use Siri anymore, and I'm a little sad. It's an end of an era for that, too, but let's randomize that trait. He is a bro. These sims can bro hug other bros. Gain com Oh my god, so he wants to be a bodybuilder. He's a vegan bodybuilder. He's a genius and a bro. This is cool. I love Sirius's personality. Add some birthday candles, and then Casey, why don't you come over here? Yeah and uh, blow out them candles. Everybody watch Casey. I can't wait to see Casey as a teen. Oh my gosh. <gasps> okay, Casey's celebrating. Here we go. Happy birthday, Casey, you're a teen. <laughs> Casey aged up. Oh, it doesn't randomize the aspiration, so we still get to use Siri. But guys, this is the moment to find out Casey's aspiration. Pick a number one through 12. The answer is two. Two, so Casey is athletic. A bodybuilder? Did I call it or what? Loves healthy living and is a glutton. Okay, and then we're gonna use this randomized trait generator to choose what her trait is. It's art lover. That tracks, I love it. She's a teenager. Oh, whoa, Casey. I feel like Casey needs a makeover, but I'm loving this short hair beanie vibe. Add some birthday candles to that. Oh, take that selfie, yes. Oh my God, queen after my own heart. Yes, queen. All right, oh my gosh, Casey is a teen. Sirius is good to move out. Say our goodbyes to Sirius, our sweet angel that is, is gonna freaking kick the world's butt. And then there were three. Bye, Sirius. Casey just needs a little bit of fun. All right, Casey, why don't you watch the comedy channel, because you're feeling sad. And then after that, you need to get a skill to level three of zero skills, no worries about that, and you need to get your homework done. Casey acquired the comedy skill. That's also a skill you can do, Casey. Aw, uh, Casey just gave a hug to Chelsea. It looks like Casey's really into turquoise right now. And blues, I like it. We're gonna have to give Casey a makeover once uh, Casey becomes matriarch, but I, I like the randomization of the outfits. It kind of informs the personality a lot. Aww, I'm pretty sure one of the kids just said congratulations to, to Chelsea. Oh yeah, Taylor's homework's complete. Whoop whoop, Chelsea, what could you get up to? Maybe you could write some more books. Do you wanna make sure to leave Casey on the best foot with the most money we can? Uh, palindrome puns, this is a playful book. Nah, we need a playful book that's sexy like Chelsea. How to seduce, the how-to book. That's quite playful and cheeky. And Chelsea can leave it for Casey in case Casey ever needs any aid in that. There you go, Casey's homework's complete. Really good job, Casey. Casey's a B student, so if we hit it just right, we might be able to get Casey up to an A in this episode. <laughs> Chelsea finished writing. Good job, Chelsea. She really needs to pee as usual. Oh my God, Casey wears glasses to bed. I wear glasses to bed too! Ah! Casey's gonna be like the other version of me. I freaking love it. Casey, go play Sims. That'll be your skill. You're gonna be fantastic, sweetie. And you're gonna have fun. Yes. Gain the skill of the Sims. Oh, Casey, no, you're starting school in about an hour. Oh no, Casey's not done with uh, all of the skills. All right, you're level up, you're skill level two. We'll have you gain more when you get home. Work hard, everybody. Oh, Casey's real miserable going to school today. What a beautiful home. We really started from nothing and now we have this gorgeous home and like 32 kids. We worked hard for this. What you doing? Oh my God, Welcome Olive came to visit. <laughs> What's up, Olive? Kira. Express your admiration. Oh. That's wonderful. Is Craig over? Looks like a, a big no. Why don't we have Chelsea just write another novel? <laughs> romance, write a romance novel. Chelsea, love me once. This is a romance book. 
Uh, the last love. You know what? No, let's make it fun. Let's make stop making things sad, Kelsey. An ocean of romance. And it's a book about two mermaids from rival clans fall in love. AKA Romeo and Juliet, but with mermaids. <laughs> All right. Grades are up. Taylor's a B student. Fantastic. Taylor is not a B student. Casey is still a B student. Okay, we got some work to do, friends. Oh my God, this is the uh -huh. first time I've seen the hair without the hat on. It's so uh -huh. cute. Just it assume. looks like Casey has more wavy hair than Chelsea does. I wonder if we should make Casey a, bl a blonde later. We we'll see. Yeah, you can come over, Theo. That's a of course, always fine. Taylor, his homework is complete. Who's upset? Probably everybody, to be honest. Go get some art going there, buddy. Whoa, Theo's over. Hey, what's up, Theo? All right, why don't you uh, draw some vi a vehicle this time? Oh, uh, Chelsea's reached handleness level five. Good job. Okay, anger management. This is Casey. Sometimes I just get so angry that I don't know what to do with myself. How can I even deal with things when I can't even? Do a workout, which would be good advice for Casey. Talk it through with someone or scream into a pillow. I think we're gonna do do a workout. I think that makes sense for, for Casey. Clean up and do another one. Yeah, Casey's homework is done. Good job, Casey. Why don't you sleep it off? Yeah, and then uh, after you're done sleeping, we'll have you play some video games, which will be good for fun and good for your skills. You could also work out, I guess, but we've already done one. We'll stick with one and then we'll adopt them all as Casey ages. Oh wow, everyone's sad when they wake up. This is a constant theme. Play some Sims. Yeah, play some Sims. Wow, that was really fast. You really like the Sims. Your fun was like zero to 60. I'll have you eat after this and then do more playing of the game. You can't age up in school without finishing all of your skills. I know, you got an hour until school. You're gonna go to school hungry. You can eat at school. There'll be snacks. It'll be fine, probably. Come on, you can finish this. Before you go to school, you can finish this. Taylor's off to school. Taylor's off to school. Yo, let's go. Sorry, Casey, but I just really needed you to do this. Now you're all good. Chelsea, meanwhile, just crushing life. Still sad. Why don't we have you f you finish, uh, finish writing an ocean of romance? Weird science. In lab, Taylor's science experiment exploded and made a big mess, along with frightening another student. We think he did it on purpose. Ah, uh, that Taylor with an O. Let's raise some manners. Academic punishment seems right. We like our kids very mannerful. Aw. Chelsea's thinking about Stacy, because Stacy reminds Chelsea that she got it going on. It's love day! We got royalties. Whew. Well, good job. Chelsea finished her novel. She's gonna take a sleep and then sell that to the publisher. Chelsea and Peter Schmee's long life is coming to an end. This would be a good time to get her affairs in order. I think we gotta do a wedding. I wanted to like do a big thing but I honestly think the backyard might be really cute wedding. So I guess let's plan a wedding. My gosh. This one comes in pink, which I love. Ah, that's so cute. Well, maybe just do a nice thing here. Let's get some flowers behind it. I feel rushed by this game and I'm not happy about that. Flowers here. A lot of nice natural flower stuff. Oh, these are quite cute. We'll do like, Stone? No. Let's do like this white. And then we'll do a nice little path. Ooh, marble. Yeah, let's just do marble here. This is an expensive situation and I love it. Chelsea deserves to be a little bit expensive right now. Let's get maybe one of these ones. Ooh, cute. They're like fireworks we could do. Oh wait, this one's even cuter. Yeah, we'll do this actually. Forget this one. This one's boring and Plain. We want everything fancy for our queen's special day here. Like got a little water feature going. This is a lot, but I like it. Are we done? Are we not done? Oh, that's, a, that's, that's, I'm getting a little bit crazy, but it's Chelsea's wedding and we're rushed it, you know? Like, it's just like, ah, we need it to be perfect. I'm pretty happy with this setup. The wedding of the century. Okay, well, now we need to get Chelsea to pick out her wedding outfit. Chelsea, wake up. It's time to pick out your wedding outfit and get ready for your wedding. Put your affairs in order because the Sims is forcing my hand. 
But dang it, are we getting a freaking wedding. She hasn't even proposed to, to him yet. And we already have set up the full wedding and buying the dress. Let's get into the formal wear. Oh, Chelsea could wear a suit to her own wedding. What a move. But let's just see what the options are. I feel like this is say yes to the dress and like when we see the dress, we'll know. You know what I mean? Like we'll see it on her and we'll all start crying. This might be the dress. It's the white version of her red dress. Ooh, we could have an island wedding. That could be quite fun, actually. Should she have a destination wedding? That kind of feels like a beach wedding with like no shoes. She gotta get that ring on her finger, you know what I'm saying? Get that ring on, girl. Are we doing this? I think we're doing this. Our Chelsea's getting married, supposedly. Oh my God, what if Chereng says no and we've done all of this work for nothing? Could you imagine? Okay, so Chelsea is all perfect and ready to go for the beach wedding. Now we just need a groom. We're gonna invite over Craig and propose. Woo, we'll propose in front of the little thing that we made and see how it goes. Actually, you know what? Let's maybe delete all of this and propose in front of this like nice little tree. I like how I spent all that time doing this thing and we're just gonna like delete it, but I'm really feeling a beach wedding for our girl. Let's call over Craig. She's wearing her seductive red dress, which I stan. He's gonna be right over. Okay, <gasps> okay, 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 okay. This is not a drill. Ah! I'm so proud of Chelsea for proposing also. Um, maybe, maybe, just do like a nice, oh, she's gonna do something herself. Let's see what Chelsea does. She's going to welcome Craig to the home. Here we go. Ke Chelsea, go get your man. Are you just talking to him? Why don't you guys go sit and chat under that tree together? Why can't I see the tree? I have to be this far out to see the tree? No, that's not okay. Oh, these are pretty. All right, that's good enough. All right, let's do it. Okay, amongst the flowers. Under the tree that we know is there, but they don't know is there. Okay, Chelsea, whisper some sweet nothings in his ear. And then, I think it's time to look deeply into his eyes. Propose, 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 Chelsea, propose. Casey's grades are up. Casey's an A student, so Casey can be the new matriarch. Meanwhile, Chelsea's proposing, this is perfect. Chelsea can move out after this. Will you marry me, Craig? Of course, Chelsea. Ah! Our OTP is getting married. They're gonna have the island wedding of our dreams. Meanwhile, let's age up our chillin'. Casey is now rising to matriarchy. Chelsea's engaged. Oh my gosh, what a big episode this is. I did not know all this would happen in this episode. Casey, 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 Casey. Wait, does that mean we should get Casey pregnant for the before the wedding? Casey aged up. All right, let's randomize the last tray. It's bookworm. I love books too. You just can't make this up, folks. Casey's pretty much perfect. Oh my gosh. Add birthday candles. Casey's a freaking adult. I feel like we should find a significant other really fast for Casey and get Casey pregnant like now. So Casey stops aging and we can get this ball rolling. Let's just check the street. Is there anyone out here? Our first, this is a big deal. I feel like we shouldn't have Casey rush into this because we can get pregnant right after the wedding. I think we should have the wedding. So Casey, why don't you go to bed? Not in the hot tub. It's Thursday, so they do have school tomorrow. The boys do. Let's get all of them kind of in a good mood. We can't possibly have a wedding with such smelly boys. But what if we wait too long? Oh my God, Charlie's congratulating Chelsea on her engagement. Charlie, our sweet baby angel, son of Craig. Ah! You know what? I think it's time. Let's plan a wedding. Bride and groom, obviously Chelsea and Craig, guests. Casey, Olive, Jamie, Charlie, Hazel. We'll get Taylor and Taylor, Brielle, Miles, Alexis, Rose. I'm picking some of the OG ones first because I want them to show up and then I'll pick some of the newer ones. Caterer is gonna be, oh my God, Naya. Yeah, Naya should cater. Select a place. Okay, we're gonna go, where's the beach? We'll just get married at the sandbar. It's right next to the beach. Ah! 
Oh my god, I'm so excited. It's a freaking wedding! I feel like this is a bigger deal than a royal wedding. Oh my god, I did not plan this well enough. It is 8 p.m. We've missed yeah, sunset. I've already effed it up. Maybe it'll be beautiful. Maybe we'll just get this wedding thing over here with what should be behind them. What's the best view? It's all darkness. There's some uh, stuff over here. That's quite pretty. We'll put it right here and then we'll put um, a bunch of lights out. Beautiful job. And then we'll get some flowers. All right, I think we did it. Change into your outfit. Oh my God, Craig is looking so beautiful. Oh, give him a kiss. Greet your fiance. Wait, there's like a siren in the water. Oh, this is cute as heck. Get married to Craig, let's do it. He's like, you know what? A late night wedding is so unique and unexpected, just like you, Chelsea. Meanwhile, Casey is feeling a little sad on the island. It would be nice if we were, who is that? A knight? Are you a boy? Let's find out what you look like. There's a knight over there, could be uh, Casey's knight in shining armor. Wait, who's this? That's a dude. Is this love? <laughs> I feel like that meme. Is this a baby daddy? While we're here, let's get Casey uh, having some introductions, you know, making some big moves. Oh my God, oh my God, this is amazing. Chelsea is getting married to Craig. This is not a drill. Why is the knight over here? The knight is watching. There's multiple knights. Is it knight knight? Why are there so many knights? You know, it's fine. Skiva Sluba. Oh my god. This is the most magical thing. Here they go. You can't even see Chelsea's face because her hair is hiding it. Congratulations, Chelsea! No one's watching, all the kids are at the bar. Typical Hunter Baby Challenge. Are you married? Spouse? They're married! Congratulations, Chelsea! And oh my gosh, wow. Casey's chatting with a, a knight. Oh, here he is, here he is, here he is, here he is. Talk about art, go get him, go get him! Casey? Casey, are you gonna seduce someone at the reception? Heck yeah, you are. Hawk this boy up on the beach. He's handsome. Get to know him. Chelsea's having a lovely time. Oh my gosh, she's like so proud. Passing off the torch. Casey's new to this whole song and dance, so first time. But wow, do I ship it. Ask about the day, get to know. They're getting along okay. He's a dance machine. Perfect. Ask about his career. What do you do for a living? Oh no, there's a kid. Making a mess, Chelsea. I think you still need to parent that and discipline that recent behavior. Calmly ask not to make a mess. Chelsea's over here being like, don't. Oh, Craig's cleaning up another mess that the kid made. Oh, couple goals. Oh, who's this guy? Ooh, these two more handsome men have a, arrived on the scene, but I think we're, we've are we got eyes for it, for the, this one, what was his name? Hawea? Hawea is our man. Try to flirt? Oh, she's quite gloomy for it, isn't she? Uh, oh no, no, don't be gloomy. Deep conversation, yeah, get in there. Get in there, girl. He is picking up what she's putting down. It's a little bit of a slower start. I feel like maybe they should go outside together. This is quite loud over here, isn't it? I feel like it's too loud in here. Let's get some alone time. He's a dog lover, how cute. He's waiting for her on the beach at late at night, it's 1 a.m. No, 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 don't leave, don't leave, don't leave. Where are you going, where are you going? Express your admiration for this. <gasps> There's a waterfall in the background. <laughs> Build a sand sculpture together. That would be cute. You wanna make a sand sculpture with me? I think they're gonna do it. They're gonna make a sand sculpture together. Oh my God, how cute is this? Oh, Casey's tired. I don't care, Casey. Gotta lay that groundwork, you know what I'm saying? Thinking about diapers. You're gonna be dealing with a lot of those pretty soon. <gasps> oh my gosh. Whoa, this is cute. What are they building? Oh my God, are they building a sand cow plant? Tell me you're not building a sand cow plant, Casey. Ask about day. Okay, Casey is feeling much more fun, so let's go in for our first flirt. Baby's first flirt at her mom's wedding. One less single girl, but one more single girl. Oh my God, here we go, here we go. He 
Loved hey. it. He's really uh -huh. liking her. Ask him if he's single. He's feeling the girl. Oh no, she's sad again. He is single, Hawea. Oh, she's like not feeling high. Oh no, why are you so sad? You let Hawea go. Chelsea's feeling fine. Look at Chelsea and Greg doing some dancing at their wedding. Wedding's almost over, so let's focus on Chelsea a little bit more. Where are all the people we invited to this wedding? Where's Olive and Charlie and, did they all leave? I wanted a nice thing for all of the kids. And they all left Chelsea at her wedding. You know, maybe they saw the event and they all had to get back because it is 4 a.m. This is, you know, the after party went late and they all went home. We're gonna make that the story instead of the fact that the kids all bailed. Passionate kiss, Chelsea. Kiss your husband. Oh, oh, oh. Amazing. Oh, we really should get going home though because the kids need probably to do some work. We're gonna end this wedding early. Would you like to move in together now? No, we're gonna cancel that. And we're all gonna take everybody home. It was a beautiful ceremony. And they partied until dawn, which is quite cute. Craig's going back to his home separately than the rest of the squad. But we can move Chelsea out with him and they can go somewhere nice. And Chelsea didn't die. Ha ha, Chelsea didn't die. Suck it. Sims. We're back at the Impeachment May household and uh, everybody needs to sleep. It's Love Day! Oh my god, Chelsea got married the day before Love Day. That's the cutest thing I think I've ever heard of. Oh, the kids need to go to school. Well, you two go to school. I know you're upset and you haven't done all your homework, but that's fine. So I don't think I'm gonna move Chelsea out until Casey has uh, is pregnant with the first kid. Casey's gotta kind of settle into being the matriarch of the house, so kind of getting things done around the house. We should maybe make Casey cook something. Oh, Casey decided to grill fruit. All right, Casey, that's your call. Look at this wall that you need to like upkeep now. That wall's gonna be yours soon. Chelsea is awake and feeling fan-freaking-tastic. Why don't you clean that up, Chelsea? Maybe you do your hygiene. Take like a brisk shower. Casey's grilling up a storm. Okay. Ah! Casey just discovered fire. This is not a drill. Oh my God, Casey. You know what, we're not grilling. We're not letting Casey grill anymore. Extinguish that. Come on, Casey, you can do it. Both of you are powerful women. Stop panicking, please, please uh, fix this issue. All right, go. No, please just go extinguish the fire. You got this, Casey. Chelsea. No, Chelsea's feeling dead. Oh my God, Chelsea's laying down. Oh my, death is here. Chelsea has lived a long life, but her time has finally come. She's dying of old age. Oh. oh my God. No, plead for her life. Don't cry, plead for Chelsea. We can bring her back, we can bring her back. Plead, 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 plead for your mother. No, no, don't take her away from us, please. Don't take her away. Please, she's friends with you. She flirted with you. Come on, you're friends. Your friends, no, no. Chelsea PGK is truly gone after Casey's ardent appeal to death fell on deaf ears. Chelsea never moved in with Craig. Casey's going to go cry it out, oh my God. Why is Death just sitting around while Chelsea's just sitting there? Oh my God. <gasps> oh my God. F you, oh dude. God. Casey, rude introduction. You go freaking tell him off, be like grim. Chelsea was nothing but nice to you. You freaking did this, are you serious, bro? I don't like your attitude, Grim. Yeah, make fun of him. Yeah, F you, dude. No, don't be friends, shove him. Maybe we shouldn't make enemies out of the Grim Reaper. But you know what, I'm not, fe she's mad. Grim's very sad. Yeah, you better be freaking very sad. Granted, it's just Grim's job. I don't know, dude, just like ask him to leave. Chelsea died on love day. Just let that sink in. Oh my God, I had all these plans. I'm gonna delete this grill. I can't look at it anymore. I mean, should we have a funeral? We'll put Chelsea by this tree where she proposed to Craig. Oh my God. You can't get to it? Oh, sorry, hold on. You need to be able to get to your mother's grave, you know? I knew this would happen, but I didn't know it'd be so soon. <laughs> this is so sad to watch. I feel like we needed an offering here. We can't just leave Chelsea's grave like empty. I think we need some stuff on it. Let's really do it up. We, get, we could get more daisies here for Chelsea's grave. I can't believe I keep saying Chelsea's grave. 
Oh my God. Maybe like a big stack of books. Like these are the books that she published while she was alive. Oh my God. I can't believe I'm even saying all of this stuff. I'm literally shook. Oh, what the date one? What the single rose? Can we put like a, oh, that's nice. Okay, well, this is gonna take a while for uh, Casey to be in a good enough mood to woohoo now, isn't it? I know this is a pretty miserable point to leave this episode, but I think I'm gonna leave this here because it feels like a fitting ending. Chelsea, as much as we're gonna seriously miss her, had a wonderful life. She had 32 fantastic kids spawned a ton of spin-offs, made countless garden salads, seduced tons of people. It's an end of an era, but I'm really excited for where we're going next. But thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys for a very exciting, fresh, fun episode next week. Don't be sad. Chelsea would have wanted it this way. <laughs>